houses. Um, the roses, we have beautiful Ginestra. We, we have empty shelves right now. To, uh, there's the tulips right down there. Um, then um, you will have cut roses. This is uh, exactly 600 of them. Um, after um, they sit here for at least a half hour, they are going to be torn. Like Katrina is going back over here with um, all the roses. Uh, we detourn every, each and every single rose that we work with. Um, Lolita is processing uh, uh, lilies. Lilies have to uh, also be cut and they need to sit out so that they open. We, we want to offer the, the, fresh, the freshest uh, that we can. Uh, then Janet and Pamela are processing lilies as well and baby's breath. Baby's breath is a wonderful um, um, filler for roses on Valentine's Day. And uh, suddenly they all went quiet. Uh, this is uh, uh, different colors that we're gonna uh, offer as well um, with an, a different kind of filler. Uh, if we come this way, you will find some beautiful lilies that are waiting to open. Um, the, these guys are pretty tight, means that they're nice and, 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 and um, fresh. Um, we are going to offer um, different things for your Valentine, like um, wonderful Philanopsis orchids. Um, if you want something different for the guys, uh, these are succulents. They're excellent for a desk. Um, you uh, could also pick up a uh, teddy bear if you like. Uh, we typically don't use teddy bears or, or balloons, but for Valentine's Days, we do. Um, so hopefully this will be um, God willing and, and with good weather, hopefully we'll have a great uh, uh, Valentine's Day.